Hi, I'm Jim Rickards, author of The Road to Ruin. Thanks for joining me. This is a great opportunity to talk about my new book, The Road to Ruin, uh, what's in it and what you can look forward to as you read it. This is the third of a series of projected quartet that I have. Uh, volume one was Currency Wars, you may have heard of. Volume two, The Death of Money. Volume three, The Road to Ruin. We'll have a fourth book a few years out. Uh, we can talk about that later. Uh, but this is a monetary quartet, a quartet of books on the international monetary system the future of the international monetary system, what's going to happen to the system, your investments, and your money. This is volume three. So what is it that we're seeing? What is it we're talking about in the road to ruin? Well, the first two books in different ways warned you about the collapse of the international monetary system, and believe me, it's coming. What happens when you're in the collapse? The road to ruin takes you there, puts you in the middle of a collapse. It shows you the reaction function or the response function of regulators and central bankers. What's actually going to happen to you and your money when this financial panic hits. So we have a sequence. The first financial panic I talk about in the book was 1998. That was the famous Russia long-term capital management bailout. Uh, you may not know it, but we were just hours away from shutting down every financial market in the world. That's not a guess or an exaggeration. I was there, I negotiated that bailout up against the banks and the Federal Reserve and the US government. I know how close we came to complete collapse. In 2008, same thing. We were just hours, if not days away from the complete collapse, sequential collapse of every major financial institution in the world. So Lehman and Bear Stearns, Fannie and Freddie had already failed. Morgan Stanley was gonna be next, then Goldman, then Citibank, then Bank of America. Who knows if JP Morgan would have been left standing, but the point is they were falling like dominoes. Every financial institution was falling. But here's the difference between 1998 and 2008. In 1998, Wall Street got together and bailed out a hedge fund. In 2008, the central banks got together and bailed out Wall Street. What's gonna happen in 2018? Maybe sooner, by the way. But 2018, if we keep up this 10-year tempo in the next financial panic, what's going to happen then? That's what I talk about in The Road to Ruin. And the picture is not pretty, because the last two times when everybody wanted their money back, and that's what a financial panic is, everybody wants their money back, the governments just printed the money and handed it out. Bailouts, TARP, interest rate cuts, Federal, Mon Federal Reserve Monetary Policy, et cetera, et cetera. They just gave everybody the money. The next time, they're not going to give you the money back. So the road to ruin, I first of all go through all this, tell you what's gonna happen, do a little bit of the history of the last two financial panics, tell you how the next financial panic is going to arise, explain this lockdown reaction function, why you're not gonna be able to get your money, and perhaps most importantly, tell you what you can do today while there's still time to preserve your wealth. There are some strategies and they're all in the book. I hope you enjoy it.